16 days, I, 16 days out, all in. You wanna be an Olympian, you wanna be a pro, start training like one, dieting like one. After my diet, dekhi, my training, dekhi, now you know what it takes to be an Olympian. To do five shows back to back in three months. Or it's still Olympia. This ain't easy. We're gonna keep going. Alright, you're good, buddy. Alright, so uh, it's finally my friend Devin, videographer. You know, you guys can see him. He's finally here. So now I can give you some content. Um, I'm shoulder training. I'm what 16 days out from Olympia, so um, it's gonna be shoulders at the zero gravity gym with Ryan. Um, this is my pre workout meal I'm cooking right now 50 grams of carbs from oats. So, I'm gonna keep it in the microwave a little longer. Um, for oats, what I've been doing is actually this time I'm using the rolled oats. So, uh, in India, we have quick oats, milte hai, you know, actually through the container of quick oats. Alright, so my coffee usually I use karta hon, quick oats which in India mein milte hain. Ye thoda se zada processed hote hain, you know, so they're easier to cook. Ye jo rolled oats hote hain, these are actually the grain of oat just rolled. So it, they're just even lower in glycemic index. So matlab digestion mein aur bhi zada slow hote hain and nutrients mein aur bhi zada nutritious hote hain. But it, they take a lot longer to cook. Just I've, been, I've already put that in for five minutes. Anyway, I think it takes about seven to eight minutes, maybe nine, depending on the uh, quantity. Hai. So um, I just switched to this because um, my carbs are so low. I was I was digesting those oats too fast. So this is helping me stay full longer. So just like try to use it, and I think I like it. The only thing I don't like about these is uh, the cooking time. So I don't think I'm gonna use these on my high carb days or in my off season. But if you're dieting pe ho or your carbs low, hai, especially if you're doing a show in India, try to find rolled oats. You know they're way better and they'll take longer. Um, other than that, I'm gonna be having three ounces of uh, so three ounces about 90 grams of chicken breast. So it's about 21 to 22 grams of protein. Hai. Um, and then I'm gonna have like a scoop of isolate, whey isolate. One of the really important things, kai log mujhse poochte hai, konsa supplement use karna chahiye, konsa protein is the best protein. See, there is no brand, I would say that is the best brand, but the important thing to look at is actually the ingredients. So if you look at the ingredients, um, isme aap dekhoge ki sirf whey protein isolate 90% hai. 28.9 gram isolate ke andar 26 gram protein hai. That's 90%, right? So when you're looking at a scoop and you're putting it in, see how much weight of that scoop is and how much of that total um, weight is whey protein. So it's 28.9 uh, grams of whey isolate hai, and total join on the hour is 30 grams. So that means 1.1 gram is all the other stuff like cocoa powder, uh, peanut flour, sucralose and stevia. So this is really pure. Like you can't find more pure than this. So make sure that your protein can there fillers and you know maltodextrin and all that. It should be isolate as much as possible. 30 gram scoop magar aapke bas 27, 26 gram protein mil hai. That's actually the most purest protein you can get. So on prep, I'm two weeks or two and a half weeks out. This is why I'm using this one because this is more pure and it won't retain water. So my oats are almost done. So that's all. I'm gonna keep my chicken now for one minute. And so what I do with my oats is I actually add some cocoa powder, some cinnamon in there as well. Cinnamon is because it's an anti-inflammatory, has a lot of antioxidants and just tastes good, a little bit of flavor. And uh, cocoa powder is like, because I like chocolate, it's a little bit calories, like one tablespoon has about 15 calories, but mostly it's fiber. So if you eight tablespoon with three gram carbs, and two grams fiber of that. So fiber can be taken out from your, um, you know, after total jo carbs or carbs. So I just like the flavor of it. I'll take all of this out like around 10 days out, you know, when I'm really, really strict. But right now 15 extra calories doesn't really boil to me that much. So I'm gonna put like a tablespoon of cocoa powder. <coughs> After doing it for so long, I realized that's about a tablespoon. A um, little bit of cinnamon, not too much, just for some flavor. 
And what I also like to do is um, add a little bit of instant coffee for flavor. Like mocha flavor, if you like it, you can add a little bit of instant coffee, which I have recently done. So I will add the just a little bit for flavor. Chicken is done. So for chicken, you know, I don't use hot sauces three weeks out. Um, unless like I, I, I'm told or I feel like I'm not retaining water. I feel like I'm not retaining water and we need to shoot content and check in there. I don't want to have extra water. Um, so I just add Himalayan pink salt. So in India, the pink salt is um, rock salt. And it's very cheap, you know, it's just better, more flavor and has more potassium. Uh, because of that pink color, so it's more nutritious. But before my walker, I like to add a lot of sodium. You know, when you're dieting, karte ho, aap, um, you're flat, and water and sodium is the only way your muscles are going to retain a pump. So that's where that's a lot of salt actually. Um, and then we're going to add about 30 grams of isolate. The thing is, I like to weigh how much I'm adding because I'll be a crunch time here. You know, I want to make sure the protein that I, I want, I'm getting that much. So that's one scoop. And that's 33 grams. So that's about 27 grams of protein that I'm getting. 27 from that, 22, 22 is say, so that's total 49. Whereas me and I needed 50 grams of protein. So I'm gonna eat this. And uh, I'll see you guys. Actually, I'm going to be chiropractor to you know, get my QL checked. I'm doing really well in my legs right now, and it's not injured as much. So um, we're going to check my QL, uh, my break, brachialis, and um, you know, we'll have to explain cutting. It's going to be in English, so bear with me because the chiros are, you know, all Americans here. I'm in US, LA right now. So I uh, try to understand. If you have any questions or comments, I'll try to make another separate video explaining what they're doing, what they're doing, and where you treatment in India. So I'm going to finish this quickly. I've got 10 minutes. Go to Cairo and then go straight to the gym. So see you guys there. I got trained legs real hard yesterday and I didn't feel my performance at all. So that's great. Yes. Ha it hasn't happened in a really long time. We dug it up pretty good. I did, yeah, and I did like real hardcore legs. Like it was like, yeah, all leg movements, everything. And I didn't fall, I didn't ball roll. I just wanted to see if I can really like do it without even rolling it. And I feel fine. I was able to do my cardio this morning good. and I didn't feel any pain. Does the rib come back at all? No, I didn't feel it. It's good. So it's actually doing really well. Um, I feel like we can still hit it, hit it <coughs> once more because I did back yesterday. So it yeah. might be like, oh, day before yesterday. Um, the only thing, yeah, just let's hit that performance again once and that lower back thing is gone too. You know, that left side lower thing that was Good. giving an issue. I don't feel that spot anymore. It was almost dead center, right? Yeah, so that you were right. It was just like a thing and it's just gone now. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, let's just do the per right performance again. QL for sure. So QL is still stiff. <laughs> when I wake up in the morning, my right side is like, I start moving and doing it, then it's fine. So I think that's the only thing that's really like it's just stiff. With you. And then uh, we'll hit these again. All right. Through the red. All right. Yeah, like right up there. Yeah. You still feeling yeah. a little bit? Just there. There are chiropractors in the hospitals and all that, but all the yeah, that's just tight. Right here. But Um, we'll do it on Tuesday just because I have to go to Garan's gym. He's gonna be like Got it. getting late. Nice to meet you guys. Yeah, nice to meet you guys. Leg day is when the nobody shows up. That's the best part. No dipping around. No fucking around. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm throwing you out of the fucking gym. I don't want to hear any shit about what you did last night or who you broke up with this week. Why yeah. <laughs> you can't eat your fucking carbs? None of that shit. All right. Heads down. Train. Shut the fuck up. Let's go. Let's go.
Uh, we're gonna break it up. I'm putting the pros together. So, boom, you four. Yep. Get ready, bro. Where is it? It's probably perfect. Yeah. perfect. I love it. Let's do this. This is gonna be a new style of training for you guys. India may as a train koi nahi karta. Aaj aapko dikhega ki training hoti kaise hai. Yeah, they do. Uh, yeah, go. Well, it's like it's like whoever. Nope. Uh, up. Up. Yeah. Up. 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 Oh, 
After doing what five six shows, your motivation comes out. And then when Calgary, I have no other heavy thing that can push me. I can push, push, I can push all my athletes, my clients, but you know they can't really push me because I'm the strongest. I am their coach, so they don't really push me. But here, I came and you see, Ryan, how much Ryan, how much weight lift, and then you know, I catch up. And then there are other pros who are, if not stronger, than equally as strong. So you want to beat them. So it's the comp competitiveness zada hoti hai yahan pe, and um, which is very important when you're training, you know, especially for something that big. Ki aap apna group jo aap training group ho, this is why either you train alone. I love to train alone because of that um, distraction nahi hota, log baat nahi karte, phone pe zada baatein nahi ho rahi. Aapne dekha ki aaj wahan pe kisi ne bhi phone nahi pakda hota. Nobody was using the phone, you know. There was I wasn't even using headphones because you don't need it. But if I train in Calgary or train in India, I train karta hon, mere headphones always in my I am training by myself so that to not have distractions. So when I are training, just make sure that you know, phones are not used. People are not being disturbed. You are not talking. If you start talking with people, your mind will go somewhere else. That mind will go somewhere else. Today, how was it? Today, how was the office? Today, how was the food? Today, how was the fight? 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 Don't focus on any of that. Training time is training time. It's like meditation. You know, nothing else matters. You know, you have to push your max absolute limit until nothing should be left think of it as like a towel towel mein pani agar aap daloge usko aap squeeze kar rahe ho kar rahe ho kar rahe ho there shouldn't be any drop left that's what your body is that's what your muscles are and that'll only happen when you're 100 percent focused so that's how you should be training and that's why i came here you know to take my training to that that extreme level ki agar it doesn't matter ki main kya place kar raha what matters is what I gave. I gave my 110%, you know, living in this room for like for three weeks, having like just training, eating and sleeping. That's it. There is no distraction. There's nobody to talk to. There's nothing to do. This is like a solitude. And bodybuilder's life is always like that. You know, if you want to reach the top, in any thing, whether you're an engineer, a doctor, a lawyer, you have to have your own solitude. Only those people that, you know, uh, reach the top. If you see Steve Jobs, you know, what do you think Steve Jobs was doing in his office? He was doing the same thing, you know. He was in his office, he was in a solitude, focusing on his vision, and that's why he made Apple. That's all you have to do if you're a bodybuilder. So, post-workout meal, nothing fancy. I have my other carbs map. Pre workout leta hon, or made a sara cardio, faster cardio, hota hai, which is like 60 minutes. Um, the reason is ki I want all my carbs in my body before the workout so I can push myself. I'm eating right now 90 grams of carbs per day and like 20 grams of fats. So that's not much at all. 
so I'm drained I want to have my muscle glycogen filled up for my workout I have energy to push muscles but I don't want to have much off from my workout it's going to hamper my recovery but three weeks out it's not about how much I can recover it's about how much I can push deplete myself kitna flat rehte ho utna hi ab lean down rahoge is is phase mein the whole thing is about to stay flat to lean down and to push yourself to the limit mentally so my post workout carbs are not at all much there are i'm eating like 20 grams of carbs so this is like about 70 grams of rice that's 61 that's like 70 grams so 70 grams of rice is 20 grams of carbs that's my carbs for my protein this is a uh, chicken breast plain koi seasoning nahi main 3 weeks out sari seasoning main kaat deta hu um you know actually did i zero it okay so we're going to have 180 grams of chicken breast this is 6 ounces so there you go that's 180 grams that's about 50 grams of uh, protein and then i'm going to have about um, 50 grams of asparagus so that's about 50 grams of asparagus grilled i like my asparagus grilled because of the flavor um and uh, that's it that's a post workout meal what i'm going to do though when i have microwaved it i'm going to add uh, you know some some salt free seasoning to ab india mein koi bhi apne is masale jo hai wo aap garam karne ke ya you know chicken ko banane ke baad dal sakte ho just make sure ki you know that's not too spicy because spices retain a lot of water so i like to use a little bit of this on for flavor and some mustard sauce um i won't use any salt after the workout all my salt intake is before my workout and just to keep my muscles full and to give me a good pump so the pump lasts you know maine pehle bhi workout mein ek week jo se episode 1 jo thi aaj mein maine kaafi detail mein explain kiya tha ki aapka sodium kyu itna important hai and uh, that's why you know sodium is very important especially at the later stages of when you're leading down but after my um after my uh, workout is done i don't need a lot of salt you know i want to be flat i actually want to get rid of all the water so jab main raat ko soonga i'm going to keep my water intake high i'm going to piss all the water out so when i wake up i'm dry and my weight is actual weight with no water so that's why i don't have a lot of salt but jo mustard salt so that i have a thoda sodium hota hai like about 50 grams 50 mg of sodium per teaspoon So I'm going to add about 15 15 grams to 20 grams like a like a squirt of mustard sauce for flavor and another reason is ki agar aap iske andar ingredients dekhoge ki kyun bodybuilders mustard use karte hain ye kafi important cheez hai ki bodybuilders mustard kyun use karte hain because there are only four ingredients or five there's vinegar there is um, some mustard seed turmeric paprika and some salt so it's very simple very basic and it doesn't retain water that's why वर्सेस अगर आप ये देखो मेरे पास हॉट सॉस है जो कि यूजली मैं यूज करता हूँ अंटिल थ्री वीक्स आउट इसमें अगर आप देखोगे तो देर इज केनोला ऑयल एंड देर इज जैंथम गम सो दो थिंग्स एज रिटेन वाटर देर आर नॉट गुड अंटिल लाइक टू थ्री वीक्स आउट तो इसलिए आई कट दिस आउट ये मैं पीक वीक में यूज करता हूँ बिकॉज यू वो कीप योर यू वो इंक्रीज द वॉटर रिटेंशन योर बॉडी डूरिंग पीक वीक and uh, my coach allows me to you know have hot sauce in the peak week so i do it but not 3 weeks out until like one week out so that's a tip you know if you are in india use your spices use the salt everything is fine but do not use extra stuff you know use like canola oil xanthan gum uh, too much spices uh, green chilies onions tomatoes all of that those are all like extra carbs you don't need the only veggies i eat is asparagus or mushrooms mushrooms with my egg whites to give it some texture or is kafi nutrient rich hota hai potassium bahut zyada hota hai folic acid hota hai zinc hota hai so it's very nutritious and uh, 50 grams mein like there's a lot of volume so it adds volume to the food so that's it that was the shoulder workout episode 2 pro to olympia and uh, i'm going to be uploading pretty much every day now leading up to olympia so you're going to see all my workouts all my dieting everything and uh, i think that's pretty much it only other thing i would say is like again you know when your the upper goal uh, pro card hai ya fir you know to lean down to a certain body fat hai aap corporate world mein kaam karte ho you want to lean down um 
the biggest thing is to actually you know just stay disciplined and just do whatever it takes you know that actually is true this is what i'm doing to whatever it takes it's not easy it's not cheap but you know when jo aapka dream hai you have to invest in it not just uh, not just in terms of money but also like financially physically emotionally all of that things have to go into your dream and when you do that that's when dreams become reality so so just remember that you know that um, just wishing is not going to do anything aapko pura pura har cheez you know has to be 100% and you have to go all in and this is what i'm doing for my dream so aapki jo bhi dream hai just go all in so that's it today shoulder um कीप ऑल फॉर द नेक्स्ट वीडियो एंड देन अगर आपको वो कैरोप्रैक्टर जो ट्रीटमेंट था उसके बारे में अगर आपको और डिटेल्स चाहिए कमेंट आई रीड ऑल द कमेंट्स मैं शायद रिप्लाई नहीं कर सकूं बिकॉज ऑफ द कितने सारे कमेंट्स होते हैं बट मैं सारे रीड करता हूं सो मेक श्योर यू कॉमेंट ऑन दैट एंड आई मेक अ सेपरेट वीडियो इन हिंदी एक्सप्लेनिंग यू नो वॉट काइंड ऑफ ट्रीटमेंट्स आई गेट एंड देन वे टू गेट दम डन इन इंडिया सो सी नेक्स्ट टाइम